Hello friends, today we will see some interesting topic in Primavera. So in this project, like we can able to apply actuals. Now we will see how to apply actuals and also we will see how to remove the apply actuals from our project. So this you can make use for any kind of project. So the same things you need to follow. So in that case, what I am going to do means like I am just considering the same project that we used before for uh, changing hours per day in calendar. So what I am going to do means like I am just going to update something. So what we can do like we can just go here in status tab and we can able to put starter and you can able to put some percentage. So 50 percentage and this one like 20 percentage. See you can't able to enter anything. Only you need to select started and then you can able to enter. Again, I'm just putting started and then 15 percentage. For example, this one started finished. So it will automatically become 100 percentage because we selected finished also. So the so fifth activity, I'm just going to leave as it is. And then the last activity, I need to put started and then just 5 percentage. See, we can able to see all these things updated here in Gantt chart. Which means like the color blue which indicates, so this blue color in this Gantt chart indicate that this activity completed. So which means like 100 percentage. So the rest of the things like uh, still in progress, but we can able to see it has started. And we can also see here it is like in green color, which means like it is not started. So now we can able to schedule. And we need to choose the current data date. And before that we need to check from the project. So from the dates, project plan to start and also data date should be equal. So what we can do means like uh, we can make both the same. So both should be same. Now we can able to go for schedule. See here it is updating. Now we can able to uh, save our log to file and then we can go for schedule. So this log file will be in documents. So now we can able to see the progress. Now based on our inputs, this is what our progress. So immediately we can able to see remaining duration and everything. But the schedule percentage complete is not updated. Why? Because we have done one mistake. Here current data date, we need to choose something apart from the actual date. Which means like we have this updation on 28th. For example, if I am telling 28th or 20 and select that on that day we have this kind of updates applying that actuals so we need to choose the date and we can schedule now we can able to see the schedule percentage complete now this is what the actuals applying the actuals so based on this like we have some kind of uh, changes over the baseline so baseline in here but our actuals ending here okay in later if you want to remove all this what we can do how to remove the applied actuals so what we can do means like we can just go to tools and then global change and here I'm just going to create a new one in the name of apply actual removal where I'm just going for a activity status when activity status equals or we can go for is not equal to not started when it is like this then what we can do we can just add something here in that we can just go for activity status again equal to like not started when it is not equal to not started it will make those activity to not started so click ok now we can just go for apply change See here we can able to see the old value and new value. See all these things will uh, uh, get changed to not started. And we can go for commit changes and no need to save the log file. No. Close it. But here we need to remove the schedule percentage complete. How? That we can just go to project and we can able to go to dates. And here you can able to change the dates. So it should be equal. So now we can able to see. So we can remove the progress the spotlight. So now we can able to see everywhere zero percentage only uh, scheduling is needed. See now we get back the previous data. 
So like this, we can able to apply actuals and we can also remove apply actuals. This is the easiest method. So using global change tool. So just make use of it. So it is similar to any kind of project. And also sometimes it depends on the activity types and activity status. Then in global change, accordingly, you need to choose and you need to uh, follow the procedure.